these unwelcome guests are causing headaches for gardeners at 12th and Commercial Drive. Garden manager Adric Brock says many people are even avoiding working on their plots. Probably a good third of the boxes are just untended. And if you look at our other gardens, like at our, our garden on, um, on Hastings Street, North Hastings Garden, every single box is, is claimed and is, is bountiful. Pest control experts are putting out poisonous bait to try and deal with the problem. Uh, this particular uh, packet you see has already been uh, chewed on, um, which is a good thing. So the fact that they're feeding off these things and they've been in place for less than a week means they're already accepting our bait, which will show a decrease in the population uh, in fairly short order. As you walk through the community garden, you can see where the rats have burrowed underneath these boxes. Now, Shifting Growth is looking into getting them raised in order to get rid of that problem. But in many cases, the problem extends beyond the garden. More people are composting their uh, organic matter. Uh, not everybody's doing it in a, a smart way. And so what we're ha having uh, all over town is piles of food lying out ready for the rats to just uh, make access to and enjoy themselves. The rats in this garden may not be enjoying themselves for too much longer. You know, and any kind of garden has its pests. Any farmer will tell you that. Um, rats just happen to be our unfortunate pest here. As he waits for the rat population to shrink, Brock is busy building plant boxes, hoping his gardeners will come back to finish the harvest season. Zach Singer in East Vancouver for BCIT Magazine.